Hi everyone, it's Casey over here from Casey's Corner and welcome to my channel. It's been a while, but I am here. I am still here. I was still active on Instagram, but on YouTube, I took a bit of a step back from recording longer videos. I was still uploading some shorts here and there, but I feel like I lost my touch with longer videos. And I feel like I still, you know, I'm, I wish to still figure it out. I have some new makeup bits, which I really just wish to sit down and just try them out with you guys because that is what I love about Kizzy's Corner is like trying out new makeup, having fun with makeup and kind of, you know, doing this as my therapy because this is my therapy, makeup is my therapy. But I feel like I've lost it a little bit, but it's fine. We're here and we're just gonna, we're just gonna go, we're just gonna go. So I'm going to be recording some videos and what I'm gonna try and do is I'm gonna start making my content a little bit shorter. So I don't want to have like 10 minutes videos or 15 minute videos. I wish to try and like at least less than 10 minutes. So that is the aim. Some content which I'm gonna be filming. Hope I have time to edit now. I miss editing as well. Now I'm going to be showing you some of the makeup bits that I have picked up since I stopped filming. Let's just begin with the first video. And the first video I have for you guys is all about this foundation. This is the NYX Bear With Me Blur Foundation. I have been seeing this all over my YouTube friends from America, but like to pick it up, it took me a while. I found it on a website, I think care to beauty or something like that, which ships to Malta. I never ordered from it. I've got this. I don't know if the shade is going to be good for me because it's a shade 04 light neutral, but that is a shade that they had. So I tested it out on my hand. I remember saying, okay, it's going to be a good shade. So hopefully it's a good shade. So for today's video, you're just going to be seeing me using this foundation and I'm going to be giving you my overall top. If you liked today's video, give it a thumbs up. And if you want to see more, then press subscribe and let's get started. So the first thing I'm gonna do is obviously Google this foundation. It is this Blair Tint Foundation and it's their first blaring foundation that blurs it all. So it blurs imperfections, pores, discoloration, texture, claims a lot of things. <laughs> It achieves instantly smooth filter like blurred skin in 24 diverse shades, made to enhance your color and tone. Medium coverage with a matte blurred finish that feels lightweight on skin and provides 16 hours of comfortable wear and 12 hours of hydration. It is formulated with glycerin, matcha and niacinamide for a skin so smooth it's better than a filter. So that is what it claims and it claims quite a bit, it's like really heavy in its claim. So I'm really excited to try it out. What I'm going to tell you is I'm going to use the NYX Hydro Touch Primer. I really like their primers. I feel like that their primers are absolutely amazing. All I have on my skin is skincare and now I've applied my NYX Primer. I really love the packaging. By the way, the packaging is so very me. Let's go. So we have the foundation. I'm gonna get my wee mirror to see a little, a little bit what, what's happening. Okay, so as cover, like as a color, like first thoughts, it's okay, it's blending fine actually. You would think it would be a bit like darker, but yeah, it's blending. So I have like some redness going on, like especially on my chin, around my nose, that is where I get the most redness. Continue blending it. Okay, I'm just going to stop for a bit and just look at what my skin looks like. Pore wise, I feel like I have other foundations which do, do a better job, even tinted foundations. The Charlotte Tilbury one does a better job as coverage, I would say. However, like it's, it's looking good. Oh, over here I have a lot of redness, so let's just see. I mean, it does cover most of it, but yeah, it's a very light coverage. I mean, they did say it's medium coverage, but in my eyes, it's more of a light, but you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna try and build it up because I really want to try and build it up. This is what it looks like after the first application. I like about these tinted foundations always is that they are so very lightweight on the skin and they're like perfect for like the spring, summer months. We'll see if it builds up as well. I'm gonna start by blending out this side. <laughs> Color, oh my goodness, it really just blends into my skin. So. I don't know, like what they said about kind of bringing out your color. I don't know if this is what they meant because I thought that this might be a bit too dark for me, but it's ending up to be a really nice, a really nice color. I have so much psoriasis on my ears, it's ridiculous. This is how my face has been covered 
with the NYX Blur Tint Foundation. And honest to God, I really like it. Like, okay, it's not the best coverage, and okay, my pores are still like shining true, but for the most part, it did a very good job at smoothing my skin, mm, covering where it needs to be covered, like the redness over here. I mean, it did it like it did, it did its best. What I'm gonna do now is I have to film some other videos and I will show you kind of how the foundation looked when I finished my makeup. And then we might do a wear test as well. I just wish to share that it's currently 9.34 in the morning and we'll do about eight hours probably. Around half five, six, I will definitely come here and kind of show you how it actually lasted because it says, you know, like it stays good for like 16 hours. So that's the claim. But yeah, I'm just going to lower a bit the light so you can see more, but it did a fantastic job. Okay, so I'm back and this is how, whoa, I am dropping everything today. This is how the Bear With Me Blair Blaring Tint Foundation looks like after I've applied on my makeup. And I just really like how it just blended in with everything, no complaints. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to be coming back in eight hours time, so it will be like six. I've taken this long to film all my videos and do all my makeup, it's 10.46. And I will show you obviously how the wear test basically wore <laughs> and we'll see. But this is the finished look, I really like it. Mm -mm. Really, really like natural, pretty. And I don't know, I feel like my skin is, feels really nice as well. So yeah, I will just see you guys later. Hi everyone, so I thought of just recording the outro well not the outro the check-in video now basically it's about six six o'clock in the evening and i just wish to give you a bit of a check-in of how my basically my hair not my hair my skin looks after eight hours about eight hours i would say of wearing the nyx bear with me uh, blair tinted foundation this is it i'm in direct sunlight i haven't used powder again so this is literally like after eight hours it's like obviously gotten really shiny over here and like my t-zone which is what it normally does my blemishes over here kind of show i think like the nicest part is always my forehead even though it is a bit shiny but apart from that i mean i mean it's been eight hours and i haven't topped it up so i feel like this is <laughs> the best that it could go here i have a bit of redness but i mean for like the coverage on the outer parts of my cheeks they're still there so that's something which i really like for a tinted foundation because this is what it is it's a tinted foundation it's actually done a really really good job hope you enjoyed today's video and yeah if you like it give it a thumbs up and if you want to see more then press subscribe i will see you guys in my next video